The 13th edition of the annual Kenya Primary School Heads Teachers Association Kepsia Conference in Mombasa County, where over 10,000 teachers are converging to take stock of the year and strategies for the year 2018. Yes, the tutors expressing reservation over the much hyped 26333 curriculum set to begin in January next year. They maintain majority of them are not well equipped to implement the new education system. 470 schools which were earmarked for capacity building have gone through that system but uh, the rest of the teaching fraternity have not been exposed to any curriculum to any capacity building so that they update themselves in readiness for the new curriculum and yet it's supposed to start next year. But uh, for most of us as heads of institutions, it, wa it was our hope that it should be started from Standard 1, thereafter Standard 2 for the next following year, I should progress uh, gradually so that we don't follow the suite of 844 that was started all together. So that as we progress, we formalize and we have that continuity in progress. Primary school head teachers are also concerned about lack of infrastructure to accommodate the high enrollment of students taking advantage of the free education. So what we need to get right from the ministry and uh, above all from TSC, we know TSC is always being empowered with finances to employ teachers. And for that matter, it is our worry that uh, we don't have enough staffing to start the new curriculum, both in the primary and secondary. And, and uh, that explanation needs to be gotten here so that we are at par with the ministry and the TSC because there is a demand for a lot, uh, many teachers being employed so that they can cope with the influx of the new uh, children that are coming to join us next year. At the same time, Kepsha Chairman Shem Dolo hailed the Teachers Service Commission for instituting reforms which he says contributed to this year's KCPE examination success. It is the only examination in the public of Kenya that never had any problem at all. There was no teaching, no leakage, and we must thank the heads of the institution, who are the centre managers, the invigilators, the supervisors and the candidates together with the parents, that joined hand to eradicate cheating. Indeed, they pocketed, and above all, the P1 head teacher that was least paid is the person who was mostly targeted. Six grades. And now they are very happy because they jumped up to five grades ahead. That was an achievement, uh, particularly from the heads association, because we benchmarked with TSC and ministry to ensure that we, we, we thickened their pockets. Education stakeholders, including Cabinet Secretary Dr. Fred Matiangi, are expected to attend the conference. Juni Karisa from Mombasa County.